All right, guys, here we are. This is the Grand Panorama Suite. You're not gonna believe this room. Let's go check it out. So let's start with the first bathroom. Now this is a half bath that's located right, right off of the entryway. Look at how nice this is. Let's head into the rest of the suite. Right when you walk in, you're just gonna notice this big, open, modern, very trendy space. You've got so much furniture, plenty of seating for entertaining or just lounging and relaxing. Let's take a walk around. While it is big and spacious, you have little nooks like this one right here where you can still get a little privacy or alone time. You also have a nice wet bar with all of your snacks, everything that you're gonna need. Let's head over to the dining room. I really like that they have a separate space over here where you can bring your leftovers, you can order out, and I mean, look at this chandelier and you have views from here as well. Right off of the dining room, you've got a really nice sitting area. I just love this long couch right against the window. I just really like the feel of this space. Here's another view, just to give you an idea of how big and open this space is, but you still have separation, like from the dining room, the other seating area that we just looked at, and this main living room. And if you're feeling up to it, play a game of pool. Something that I thought was interesting was all of the books that are throughout this suite. I don't know too many people that go to Vegas and sit in their room reading books that they find in there, but you know what? Aesthetically, it was a nice touch. Let's head into the bedroom. You're probably noticing a common theme is the large windows that let in all that natural light throughout the entire suite. This bed right here has a TV right in the footboard so that while you're lying in bed right there, you can watch television. And again, all of your controls are gonna be in one space for the bedroom here. Really nice closet with plenty of room for all of your belongings. Let's take another look before we head into the bathroom so you can see how nice and clean and the, how the natural light just fills this space. Just love it. Heading into the bathroom, the first thing you're gonna notice is this nice soaking tub right when you walk in. Look how inviting that is. You also have some more storage over here for your things.
just opposite of the tub, you're gonna have a nice double sink with a big ringlet mirror. I just really like the feel of this one. You're also gonna notice the bow ties throughout. If you really look, you're gonna see bow ties like this all over the property as well as inside of the rooms. And just opposite the sinks, you're gonna find your walk-in shower as well as toilet area. Look how nice these doors are though. Let's head on back out. I'm gonna show you another really nice feature for this suite right here. This suite right here also features automatic sheer and drapes. I have to say, one of the things that seems to be a theme throughout the entire property, as well as the rooms, is the natural light. And of course, all of the views. All right, guys, that's a wrap on this one. Comment below, have you stayed at the Fountain Blue yet? Is it on your list? We wanna hear from you guys. Share your experience below. Thank you so much for watching this, supporting our channel. We appreciate you guys. 24 hours a day, seven days a week in a city that never sleeps, Ninth Island Connection will take you there. You won't want to miss a beat as we give you a sneak peek inside the biggest, best, and most outrageous hotspots both on and off the strip. Be sure to tune in to Ninth Island Connection with Sebastian Rodriguez every week. Great people, great stories, great connections, only on Ninth Island Connection.